Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can enter and save transactions that you create for use at a later date. These types of transactions are called memorized transactions. Sage 50 can memorize and save quotes, sales invoices, purchase orders, payments, and general journal entries that you make frequently so that you can use them again in the future without having to retype the information within them in their entirety. When you use a transaction that you've memorized, you can still edit the information so that it fits the particular situation. In this way, they're more flexible and usable while still saving you some typing time. The first step is to create the transaction that you would like to memorize. You will have to use the Maintain Memorized Transaction Type window to do this, and you can access it by selecting Maintain from the menu bar, rolling down to the Memorized Transactions command, and then choosing the type of transaction that you want to memorize from the side menu that appears. You will then enter the information that you would like to have reappear whenever you create a copy of this transaction in the future. Note that you do not have to enter information into every field. Just enter the information that you want to have appear within the copy when you create it in the future. You will have to enter information each time that you use the transaction in the future for fields such as the invoice number and date. Now once you've created the transaction, just click the Save button in the toolbar at the top of the window to save it. You can then use that transaction in the future by accessing it through the window that you use to enter the type of transaction that you memorized, like the Sales Invoicing screen for Memorized Invoices, for example. Within the associated window, click the drop-down button that appears next to the List button in the toolbar at the top of the screen. Then click the Select button that appears in the drop-down menu. Sage 50 will then show you a listing of the memorized transactions that you have created for this type of transaction. Just select the one that you want to use and then click the OK button. The memorized information for that transaction will then appear within the form. You will then just have to add in any unique information that you need to complete the transaction and then click the Save button in the toolbar at the top of the window to save the information. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.